সুপ্রিয় দর্শক আপনাদের আমন্ত্রণ জানাচ্ছি আপনাদের প্রিয় অনুষ্ঠান এন টিভির বিশেষ অনুষ্ঠান আজকের আলাপনার প্রতিবারের মতো আমি আকরামুল হুসেইন আছি আপনাদের সাথে আমরা বিভিন্ন সময় বিভিন্ন টপিক নিয়ে আপনাদের সাথে আপনাদের সাথে সামনে তুলে ধরার চেষ্টা করি এবং আজকেও তার ব্যতিক্রম নয় প্রতিবারের মতো আমরা আজকে আরেকটি সংগঠনকে আমন্ত্রণ জানিয়েছি দ্য ব্রিটিশ বাংলাদেশি অ্যাচিভমেন্ট এবং ব্রিটিশ বাংলাদেশি অ্যাক্টিভিটিস নিয়ে আপনাদের সাথে তাদেরকে তাদের বিষয়ে কথা বলার জন্য আমরা যাদেরকে আজকে আমন্ত্রণ জানিয়েছি তারা আমাদের এই অন্যতম একটি বাড়া বাংলাদেশে অধ্যুষিত অন্যতম একটি বাড়া ক্যাম্পডেন বড় অফ কাউন্সিলের বিশিষ্ট কয়েকজন ব্যক্তি এবং যে উনিশশো সালে নাইনটিন তে বেঙ্গলি ওয়ার্কার্স অ্যাসোসিয়েশন নামে যে সংগঠনটি তাদের যাত্রার মাধ্যমে বাঙালির অধিকার আদায়ের সংগ্রামে কাজ করেছিল সেই সংগঠনের নীতি নির্ধারক এবং সংগঠনের কর্তৃপক্ষকে আমরা আজকে আমন্ত্রণ জানিয়েছি আমাদের আজকের আলাপনে আমরা কথা বলবো তাদের সাথে কথা বলবো তখনকার সময়ে বাংলাদেশিদের যে বিভিন্ন ধরনের বঞ্চনার শিকার হতে হয়েছে যে বিভিন্ন কারণে যখন বাঙালিরা বিভিন্ন ভাবে বঞ্চিত হয়েছিলেন এবং বঞ্চনার কারণে যেভাবে আজকে আমরা প্রতিষ্ঠিত হতে পেরেছি আমাদের বিভিন্ন প্রতিষ্ঠার ফসল যে বাঙালিদের কারণে আমরা পেয়েছি এবং তাদের আত্মত্যাগের বিভিন্ন কারণ আমরা আজকে আপনাদের সাথে কথা বলবো আর চাই প্রথমে আমি পরিচয় করে দিতে চাচ্ছি আমার আজকের সম্মানিত অতিথিদের সাথে আমার ডান পাশে আছেন কাউন্সিলার নাসিম আলী অবি ধন্যবাদ আপনাকে আজকের অনুষ্ঠানে আসার জন্য আমার ফার রাইটে আছেন সালিক মিয়া ডাইরেক্টর অফ বেঙ্গলি ওয়ার্কার্স অ্যাসোসিয়েশন আপনাকে ধন্যবাদ আজকের অনুষ্ঠানে যোগ দেওয়ার জন্য আমার বাম পাশে আছেন খুবই সুপরিচিত এবং একজন ইয়াং ওমেন অন্ট্রপ্রনর পলিটিশিয়ান ফরমার মেয়র অফ ক্যাম্পডেন কাউন্সিল কাউন্সিলার না দিয়ে আসা থ্যাংকস ফর কামিং টু দি শো টু নাইট শো অ্যান্ড দেন আফ গট অ্যানদার এ ভেরি গুড businessman and entrepreneur abdul samad and chair of bengali workers association thank you very much for uh, coming to this show assalamu alaikum thank you thank you shubhyo doshok amra ajke jaderke amontro janiyechi tara prokrito pokkhe ekti sanghotoner sathe kaaj kore aschen ebong british community te bibhinno bhabe bangladeshi je shopno she shopno ke lalito kore bangladeshi gorber itihas gorober itihas tule dorar chesta korchen amar bam pashe jeni achen councilor nadia sha former mayor of camden council abaro apnake dhonnobad janacchi ajker onushthane jog deyar jonne amra ajke kotha bolbo bengali workers association niye you know you you are the mayor of camden council and then you know camden is going to be a Uh, uh, very uh, diaspora uh, for Bangladeshi community mm. and there are so many organization now uh, is increasing and uh, as you can see the Bengali Workers Association has been established from 1973 mm -hmm. can you just tell us something about this organization so the Bengali Workers Association is um, more widely known as the Shimmer Center um, and we were one of the first if not the the first uh, predominantly Bangladeshi organization in the UK mm -hmm. um, and um, the center itself was built in 1980 in mm -hmm. the early 80s um, following um, some incidents which happened unfortunate incidents which happened um, where Bangladeshi families were not getting the right service provision mm -hmm. um, and also um, it was set up to meet the needs of the community at the time in terms of education, integration, um, cu uh, celebrating culture, mm -hmm. um, identity, um, providing a platform for young people, mm -hmm. for women, uh, for the elderly. Um, so it's been around for a very, very long time but uh, it was based What on... What service are you offering for women? at the moment so at the moment i mean over the years it's changed um quite a lot because what we've seen is women becoming more involved in mainstream uk life so in the initial stages there were there were a lot of esol classes happening lots of um skills building for women to be able to have employment or even just to get them out of the house and integrate into society now thankfully we have volunteers who are women themselves who have been trained by the summer center we have specific activities for women mm -hmm. uh, we have employment advice for women um, and the whole the whole theory behind the summer center is to um, meet the needs of our community but bring our community forward thank you very much thanks for your fantastic explanation for shoma center uh, abdul samad uh, you are the chair of this uh, association what's your dream okay um, first of all my dreams already happened because 
when I when I was a youngster and when I was growing up in Camden, we really didn't have any place. You're Camden boy. Yeah, we really didn't have any places to go. So the one and only shelter was Bengali Workers Association, a Shuma Centre, mm -hmm. where we could go. We could, you know, after school, we, it had after school clubs, we could participate in activities, playing snooker. At that time when we were growing up, there was nothing else in the borough. So I'm very thankful to all the people that put a lot of effort and time mm -hmm. and created the Shurma Centre. And, um, and I'm privileged to be the current chair of it. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Uh, Salik Bhai, after uh, you uh, as a director and former secretary of uh, the association, uh, development for a community, and uh, you can say uh, the support from the community, as a, what you are offering from the uh, association. Thank you for the question. <coughs> when I became involved with the Shirma Center, uh, I think in 1992. Um, that time, <coughs> I was holding a position called Education Secretary. Mm -hmm. um, that time, um, there are a number of services um, in the center, including uh, sorry, including um, uh, advice service for mm -hmm. the people who are on low income, uh, youth service, mm -hmm. education employment service, um, nurse, um, uh, nursery provision for uh, children. Mm -hmm. Um, also, there were <coughs> provisions called um, Homer Club for uh, school age young people who are struggling or who are underachievers um, in their education because of the language barrier or other barriers. So that, that was really, really helpful because we were uh, able to provide the basic needs of the community and we were catering almost you know, every um, section of the community. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. We'll come back to you. Yeah. Uh, Councillor Nasim Ali Obi, Amra Shobar Kast ki shun chilam, Shorma Centre niye je, one ke shop no, one ke offer ki apna dil chen. But seems it's similar to other associations. Mm -hmm. But can you just tell me any special sure. uh, about uh, this uh, association, yeah. Bengali workers? The name carried yeah. the Bengali yeah. uh, struggle in the time we passed. I think what's very special about Bengali Workers Association is that for me. I started going there in 1976 mm -hmm. and it helps the British Bangladesh community to actually advance. So with Nadia, we had the first British Bangladeshi female mayor in the country mm -hmm. and it wouldn't have happened if Nadia didn't get the support from the Bengali Workers Association. Oh. And for Very myself, good. I was the first British Bangladeshi and Muslim mayor in the country uh, for Camden and the youngest mayor in the country and also the first British Bangladeshi leader. Wow in Camden managing a billion pound budget for, for Camden and none of that would have happened if it wasn't for the Shurma Centre. So as everyone said, the Shurma Centre is special because it supported the British Bangladeshi community to advance, mm -hmm. to progress mm -hmm. and to actually make sure that we're supporting in terms of education, employment, training and now where our older uncles, fathers, grandfathers are getting much older and then they, they need the support now. We're providing the welfare rights advice. We're providing it s Thank for you. older people. Thank you. We'll, we have to go a short break, sure. commercial break. Uh, we have to ask our workers, Bengali Workers Association. We have to ask our workers 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 to ask our work